Ephesians chapter 5, verses 1 through 2 exhorts, Follow God's example, therefore, as dearly loved children, and walk in the way of love, just as Christ loved us and gave himself up for us. Love is the central value in the kingdom of God. Jesus was asked, what's the greatest commandment? And he said it was to love God with your whole being. And the second greatest is like it. Love your neighbor as yourself. He's telling us love is not optional. Love is not a declarative. It is an imperative. It is a must-do. We must love as Christ loves. So the most common word in both the commandments is love. So there is no way to become like Jesus without growing in love. If you're not growing in love, you will not become more like Jesus. Plain and simple. So what comes to mind when you hear me say the word love? Do you think think of the adrenaline surge of the Six Flags Goliath roller coaster? I love that roller coaster. Or the dog you have, you love that dog or that cat? It's not that kind of love. It's not the romantic love you may be thinking about. Or the love you have for chocolate cake or whatever it is. It's not that. In the Bible, love is not defined by a feeling. Love is acting in the best interest of someone else.